<laughs> Greetings, ladies, gentlemen, boys, girls, likers, dislikers, commenters, new subscribers, old subscribers, and just generally anybody who watches these videos. Welcome back. Incoming! <laughs> it is one foggy day. Like fog, nobody can see you. It's a tugger. Sure, ladies and gentlemen, as you'll know, the whole redundancy thing with work and stuff like that are, has arisen, and um, one of the options I actually started looking at for a better life, so to speak. Um, I actually started looking at it two, three, four, four months ago, and that is possibly making my own business, possibly being related to motorcycles. Can't really tell you much more than that because then someone will come over here and steal my idea. But ready, ready, ready. I should work on a farm. So yeah, I was actually considering starting my own business until I seen the price of starting my own business. That is one large amount of money. So it is. I think I was working on the average of a startup capital sort of stuff about fifteen grand, fifteen twenty grand at least, and. Uh, It really has got me attention, but the only way I get that sort of money is selling my soul to investors or groveling the invest and I to give me some money. But I don't know, I'll close this down. The wind is awful today. It actually, well, it it couldn't it couldn't work. It would be a, a very good idea and if it was to take off it would it would have to be a sustainable thing and nothing short of someone running me over and me getting the big payout but yeah it's not really easy when you can't really get the confidence up the pitch to people uh, you're a bit useless at figures and you have to hire an accountant. Well, you don't have to, but I would because I am stupid. It is, it is an intriguing idea, and it is something I have ideas that I think are great, and then to go away, and you know, you sort of get a wee bit of bite of reality on them. But this idea, as long as I leave it, it doesn't go away. When I look at it more and more, it gets deeper and deeper. It's something for the future, but and to be self-employed gives you a wee bit more freedom. You know, you don't have to work for somebody, you're working for yourself. So you are sort of pushed to make your own success. Oh my god! Shetlands! Wee baby horses! Sorry, sorry. So yeah, that's something that could happen in the future. If I win the lottery, or if I just decide, screw it, I'm doing it. I really need to get away from this lorry. It is spraying up a storm. The best thing is, I did a GNVQ in business studies in school. You ever get that time where you ever say to yourself, I wish I listened more in school. This is one of them days where, well, one of these times where I actually do wish I listened in school. I know all the techno jargon, but oh, life, I tell you. If it was that easy, you could just write what you wanted to be right at the start and do it. You never know someday in the distant future. 
you could be using a an XT Donkey Industries facility. And if you are, let me know because the person stole my name and is running a business under me. Just kidding. It is food. It is food for thought. It is something that. I had sort of deeply considered, but I is dummy and dummies sometimes don't do well. For obvious reasons, I'm not telling you what the business is, as I've said before. You just might come over here and steal it. That lorry's full of poles. A few planks and a ladder. Yeah, so uh, if you have any advice, you know, a bit close. If you have any advice for starting businesses, I know Moto Tangle, you're going to be in here somewhere. I know it. Maybe not. But I think it was I think it was Moto Tangle actually suggested starting my own business. You know, if you have any advice, let me know in the comments in the below. It is always greatly welcome. You never know. Someday I could attribute my success to you guys and girls. And that's about it. I really just wanted to share this thought. Here's some some uh, advices and maybe you know feedback. But as always, if you have enjoyed this video, and I know most of you always do, don't forget to like. If you want to comment, I will reply. And if you haven't already, I keep banging on about it. Don't forget to hit subscribe. We're nearly there. And as always, don't forget, keep it lit. And if there's something threatening your job and you can't keep it lit, maybe starting your own business is a good idea. Incoming! <laughs> Hehehehe <laughs>